whole life, I wanted to travel. I wanted money, girls. I wanted to do things. I wanted to experience things. You ever wanted more for yourself? You ever wonder if maybe you were capable of having more and doing more than you are now? You ever wanted to start your own business and make money? Why hasn't it happened? Why don't you have these things? Why are you still dreaming about it and not doing it? When's it going to be your turn? Some people are doing it. Why aren't you? They're not better than you, are they? They're probably not smarter than you, are they? The reason other people are able to accomplish things that you haven't is not because they're smarter or better than you. It's because they know some things that you don't know. I came from nothing. I was able to start my own businesses. I work for myself. I make my own money. And the thing is, you probably work harder than me. Like the average janitor works harder than me. Why? I'm probably not even smarter than him. But I just know some things that he doesn't know. And you can know those things too. Let me explain. Years ago, I was just like you. I was struggling. I was probably worse. Most of you were probably way better off than I was. There was a point where I was sleeping in my car. And I would have to shower at the gym. I was homeless. Even when I was finally able to get off the street and have a place to live, I still didn't have enough money. Sometimes I didn't have enough money to take the subway. I would be one of those guys outside of the, outside of the turnstile asking you for a swipe on your metro car because I didn't have two dollars and fifty cents to ride the train and if all that weren't enough one day I'm at home with my mom she asked me to come home because you know something some dramatic had happened there's a knock on the door it's the police they asked us to sit down and they explained to us that they found my father's body bullet in his head. My mom starts crying. She starts to panic. And I immediately understand that now I'm in charge. I'm the man of the family. And as the man of the family, I need to provide. I have to make sure everybody's okay now. I have to make sure everybody's needs are attended to. And that's when I decided that I have to start making money now. I had no fucking idea how to make the amount of money I needed to accomplish my goals. See, I had big goals. I didn't just want me and my family to survive. I wanted us to thrive. I'm talking about abundance. But I had no idea how to create that. So I started working for other people. I got a bunch of jobs. I had three, four jobs. I was working security. I was working for a moving company, which is the hardest fucking work I can think of, and doing personal training. But it was still never enough money. And then I realized, the people who had the money, the people who had abundance, were writing my checks. They had their own businesses. So I realized that if I wanted abundance, if I wanted financial success, then I would have to start my own business and be an entrepreneur work for myself instead of working for someone else so I started getting my own clients for personal training but that was cool it was better than working for someone else but I was still exchanging time for money you can never get really rich by trading time for money because you can't scale it there's only 24 hours a day and you have to sleep for at least a few of them then I tried network marketing uh, you know the little pyramid businesses that your friends try to con you into joining with them. But then I started to have some success when I started doing online business. When I started my first online business is when I first started to see glimpses of hope. And that's when I realized that this was the right path because you can make money online 24 hours a day, even when you're asleep. So I set out to discover everything I could about internet marketing. 
everything I could about starting and running an online business. And that's when I realized it wasn't my fault. You see, because I had a marketing degree from one of the best business schools in America. And they weren't teaching me the real ways you can make money online. They were teaching me how to work for another person. But when you're working for yourself online in a small business, the rules are totally different. It's stuff they don't teach you in school. It's stuff that no one's teaching you. No wonder I was struggling. I paid all this money for school, and they were teaching me stuff that wasn't going to get me rich. They were teaching me how to become an employee, not how to become an entrepreneur. See, for years they've been telling you that if you just work hard, go to school, get a good job, you'll be financially successful. And that's bullshit. Now the odds are if you go to college, you'll be better off than a guy who didn't go to college. But that doesn't mean you'll get rich. I don't want to be better off than the average motherfucker. I want to get rich. To say, I want to create so much abundance that my great-grandkids will be taken care of. Their lives will be better because of the foundation I laid today. And then people say, oh, money will make you happy. Success will make you happy. That's not what the fuck we're talking about. We're not talking about happiness. We're talking about success. They're two different things. We're talking about financial success. Yeah, it won't buy you happiness, but here's the thing. Happiness won't buy you food either. I know what it's like to wake up hungry. I know what it's like to wake up hungry and not know how the fuck you're going to eat that day. And my goal is to create so much abundance that no one in my family will ever have to know that pain. You see, but the school didn't teach me that. School taught me how to be an employee. School taught me how to work for another motherfucker. Because that's the real problem. The real problem is the system is not set up for you to succeed. Do you think that the elite, the people at the top, the elite really want you to join them? Or do you think they want you to work for them? Do you think they want you to get rich and successful? Or do you think... They want you to help them become rich and successful. Just think about that for a second. Once I realized that working for myself was the key and setting up my own business in a manner where I was not exchanging tight time for money, that's when I really started making money. And I really started making money fast. And it's not only me. I've also taught other people how to do this. There was a time last year when I was doing coaching. And it goes against my business model of exchanging time for money, but I thought I could help people. It was more intrinsic. I did it because I wanted to help others realize what I realized. So one of my students, he just sent me an email the other day, told me that because of our coaching session and the plan we laid out for him to start his own business, he was able to finally quit his job. He was able to release the shackles from his feet. He got his freedom papers, baby. See, I didn't realize when I started this that not only does it make you money, but it also gives you freedom, right? Because money is freedom. I wake up every day and I don't have to do shit to make money because it's already set up. I used to have to wake up at a certain time because I had to go out and make money because if I didn't I would die either of starvation or cold from being kicked out of my house now I wake up because I want to it's freedom man it's hope but what I didn't realize is how much happier I am and it's not because of the money it's because of the freedom and the control. You see, now I feel like I'm in control of my destiny. I feel like I'm in control of my life. Prior to this, I felt like I was at the mercy of others. Because I was. A lot of you guys are feeling like that. You don't have to. I don't want you to feel like that. I want you to join me. I want you to liberate yourself. I want you to feel the confidence and strength that comes from working for yourself, from building your own business from nothing and to be able to make it profitable to the point where you can take care of yourself without 
waiting for someone else to, to pay you every week. Without waiting for someone else to tell you when you can and can't take a vacation, take a break. I want to help you abolish you from this economic slavery. And I offer you freedom. I want you to feel this freedom. I want you to feel this, this confidence. I want you to feel this prestige. I want you to feel this power. That's why I wrote my new book, Money to Blow. Your ultimate guide to financial freedom and balling hard as fuck. I want you guys to really understand what went into me writing this book. It wasn't just me sitting down and typing. The knowledge in this book comes from years of trial and error. Right? It comes from years of trial and error, of trying to become financially successful, falling down many times, having to pick myself back up. Years of struggle and then finally making it. My hope is that you guys will read this book, apply the principles, and then you will accomplish your financial goals a lot faster than it took me. I hope that your learning curve is a lot shorter. I hope that you don't have to go through the struggles I went through. I hope you don't have to waste the money I wasted. I hope that you can you can accomplish your financial goals in record time, way faster than me and way better than me. Most of you guys are probably smarter than me. I'm borderline retarded. I was diagnosed with dyslexia and ADHD as a child. There's no reason why you can't do what I've done. The only difference between you and me is that I've learned some things you haven't learned yet. And that's why I wrote this book. So you can learn these things without having to go through what I had to go through. By following the plan I lay out in this book, you'll be able to finally get out of debt so you no longer have to feel the burden of having to pay creditors every month or to struggle to get by. This book is going to tell you how to make money without having to spend time doing it. This way, you're not trading time for money and you can make money on this side. This book is going to show you how you can go from having no money or even negative money if you're in debt to having enough money to buy the things and do the things you always wanted. So you can finally realize your real potential because struggling financially is limiting you. Money can't buy you happiness, but how much happier could you be if you didn't have as many economic limitations and restrictions? Do you think you could be happier? You had more freedom to do what you really love? Do you think you'd be happier if you had more time to spend on the things and with the people that you love? Money won't make you happy, but lack of money will leave you in bondage and restrict your options. So this is what you're gonna, that's what you're gonna get in the book. You're gonna learn how to start your own business, but you're also gonna learn how to get your finances in order. You're also going to learn how to get out of debt. You're also going to learn how money works so you can control it instead of it controlling you. This product took me over a decade to make because it's a decade worth of trial and error. It took me a decade to finally become financially successful. This book will get you there way faster. I should charge $1,000 for this shit or at least $100. You know what? I should at least charge $100 for this book. I should at least charge $50 for this book. I mean, that'd be reasonable. That, that'd be worth it at $50. And if all this book did was get you out of debt, would it be worth that? Would it be worth $50? If all this book did was help you finally become financially secure so you didn't have to worry about money, would it be worth that? If all this book did was help you start a business where you weren't exchanging time for money so you had more freedom to do the things you love and spend time with the people you love, wouldn't it be worth $50? All right, so, but I'm not going to charge you that. I'm not going to charge you $1,000. i am not going to charge you $100. i am not going to charge you $50. i am not going to charge you $20. i am going to give you the first chapter for free. 100% free. 
That's because I want as many people as possible to get the benefits. This is my gift to the world. This is me wanting to help other people who may feel hopeless. Because where I come from, I come from the south side of Chicago. Murder capital of the world. A gang-infested wasteland where extreme poverty is the norm. And the biggest problem with growing up in that environment is that you feel hopeless. That's how I felt. I felt hopeless. I'm giving the first chapter away for free because I want to give you hope. I want to show you another way. But it's only going to be available for a few days. I'm only going to keep this book available free for a few days and then I'm going to start charging for it. It's only going to be free for about a week. Then I'm going to start charging for it. But I want to give you an opportunity to get it for free, bro. I want to give you an opportunity to get it for free. I want to give you an opportunity to accomplish your goals. To be who you're supposed to be. To finally rise to your potential, man. I'm already on the path, man. I'm balling. Come ball with me, man. Don't you want to ball?